that varies from show to show, but um, a lot of the times you have to give written documents uh, describing what the story is. Sometimes you can just pitch it over the phone, and usually once a show has been on the air for a while, you're, you're just pitching it briefly to them. Um, I can't remember what we did on Hack. Family Law, we would give them outlines. Most shows give outlines, you know, and you pitch, and then you give an outline, and they have comments every step along the way. On House, I was lucky enough that we relatively quickly got to the point where I could just, they trusted me enough that I would just, or whatever, that they would, I would pitch a bunch of stories to them, and then the next thing they'd see is the script. It just, it, I, I found it, you spend so much time fine-tuning the document not for the sake of the story, but for the sake of that specific reader. And I just found it not an efficient use of time. So you would get to know the executive's personality and make sure that the tone was, was right? A or? little bit, yeah, and make sure that it's, it's readable. Because, I mean, outlines by their nature are not as interesting as a script. You know, there's stuff that's missing. And um, so you'd have to find a way to make it interesting within a much shorter document. And how hard would you dig in and fight if you got a note that you didn't agree with? It depended on the note. Um, well, if I didn't agree with it, um, you'd fight. You, you have to do what, uh, Hack was a big problem in a sense that way. Hack became a show that they didn't want to do the way I wanted to do it. Usually you're, you know, you're here and they're here or something like that, or it's a specific scene which they think is not working. And, and I, I do believe in the note process. I do believe uh, that you, ha you are answerable to your audience. If your audience is not getting what you are trying to put across, that is your fault, not your audience's fault. And the network is part of the audience. And if they read it and they're not reacting the way you want them to react, you have done something wrong. If they say an audience isn't going to get this, then you can say, did you get it? Yeah, I got it, but I, then you, can pro you might be able to ignore it. But if they just are, if they're not acting like a viewer, then you can sort of ignore it. But if they said, I, I wasn't crying here, or I wasn't laughing here, then you probably did something wrong. Having said that, um, you know, when they tell you, this didn't work, do this, Second half of that statement's almost always wrong, and the first half of the statement's almost always right. You know, so don't, they're not writers. That's not their job. But if they didn't react to something, you have to figure out why. And it may have something to do with that scene, it may have something to do with scene 10 scenes earlier. You have to set up the characters, you have to set up the situation so it pays off the way you want it to. So it may be a big note, it may be a small note. They may not know.